in this video, I'm going to do part B of this question. I missed doing this question from paper two. I will definitely leave a link to this question in the main video as well, so you guys don't miss any questions from the main paper. But this one is pretty easy, should not be a problem. So first we have AB as 3, 2. So AB, so this is A, B. Then we have BC as this one. This is BC. And then CD as this one. Let's say it's, it's like that. No big deal, right? Now question, find AD. AD will be AB plus BC plus CD. So we add everything to find AD. So let's do that. So 3 plus 6 is 9. 9 minus 7 is 2. 2 plus minus 2 is 0. 0 plus minus 3 is minus 3. That will be AD, part 1. Now part 2 is find the magnitude of BC. So we just use a formula to find the magnitude pretty easy. So square root of the first value square plus minus 2 square. That will be 36 plus 4, which is root of 40. This is your answer for part 2. And now for part 3 is, given that A is the midpoint of BC, find A. So BC is right here. Let's say it's the midpoint. So how do you find A? You have to find AB plus B, right? Now what is B? So B we know is a midpoint of this one, so pretty easy. Half of BC will be uh, 6 minus 2, that should be 3 minus 1. Now to find A, that will have to be AB plus B. So AB is 3, 2 plus 3 minus 1. That will be 6, 1. So 6, 1 will be the answer of this question. Okay, so that was uh, pretty straightforward. Um, I will definitely leave the link in the main video so you guys don't miss this question. Uh, one more time, thank you for watching. I will see you soon.